Okay. Hi, I'm Bonnie Walters, publisher of Destination Publications. I'm here with Karen Seal, who's one of my classmates, or, or well, actually the president, past president, of Leadership Pinellas that I met with a while ago, and she's also one of the uh, county commissioners, and she's here at the Clearwater Jazz Holiday. Uh, um, tell us a little bit about the experience that you're having here tonight. Well, this year is probably more magical than ever. If you look around, you'll see the ambiance that was created by Susan Becker Ross, another Leadership Pinellas um, graduate. And um, it's just going to be an evening of sound and um, sound and pleasure with everybody just relaxing. We've enjoyed the sunset tonight. Um, and every year, this holiday gets better and better. And we're proud through the Church Development Council to support uh, Jazz Holiday. And so uh, tell me a little bit about how the Pinellas County gets involved with this kind of an event. Pinellas County, um, actually through the Tourist Development Council, helps to promote all the local events here in Pinellas County. And this is the premier one in Clearwater. And so um, they actually, the city of Clearwater and Jazz Holiday, asked for special events, support, monetary support, um, which did come through the bed taxes. That's and great. so it helps to bring better performers, more stellar performers, and to put on the kind of great so the yeah so the uh, the Pinellas County actually helps and helps um, support the some of the special events that are going on in the area to help promote the community and get more people to visit here and and to enjoy themselves here both residents and visitors we do and it's all again it's done through the bed tax that's paid when somebody stays at a hotel so it's not a local tax on our citizens it's rather paid by our visitors to then help to fuel special events throughout the county. That's great. So about how many visitors are you uh, expecting here at this event? Um, typically, Jazz Holiday pulls in about 30 to 40,000 people over the weekend. Wow. Um, That's got to have a great impact. Yeah, you know, maximum capacity is usually about 15,000 per night. Wow. And um, it... It's, so you guys have done a great job in supporting this event. We want to thank you for doing that. Thank you.